Oh. Oh. <laughs> Soft egg. Soft egg. Soft egg. Gynax. And Gynax. Some of you, well, I mean, you saw the the thumbnail, really. There's very little, like, actual surprise about this. But it's Princess Maker 2! Oh, yeah. Yeah! Oh, boy. Welcome, I, uh, everybody. Yeah. We've been, we've been planning on this since the beginning. <laughs> yeah, since the beginning of the channel. This was on our list of games that we were planning to play uh, since... 2015 when we started yeah. this channel back in November we were like what games should we play um, and and like it was even like one of the first ones that you said we, we should play is yeah. uh, is Princess Maker it was like, I would love to do Princess Maker 2 and then there was like some um, some confusion well not necessarily confusion but there was some debate as to how um safe or unsafe it was to play princess maker 2 on the channel and stuff like that and yeah um you know we were it, it was it was not really necessary to um to to be that worried about it all but um there well we are. this game is steeped in a lot of weird shit yeah yes. like a lot of japanese stuff like it's true. Came out around this is, I mean, it, it's created by Gynax, which is a, uh, w which is a, a kind of a weird uh, company in in and of itself. It did a lot of things uh, like anime and stuff like that that is considered that would be considered sort of inappropriate in the current day. Uh, right, right. This game has its moments, certainly. Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, but are we uh, are we good with the uh, family name level zero? I'm I'm perfectly fine with level zero to be the family. All name. right. Oh, we need a first name for our daughter. Oh, okay. Well, what is it going to be? Well, we could go with Noni, but Noni's kind of cursed. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yes. Um, <laughs> this almost feels like... Qu okay. Questobel. Questobel. Questobel <laughs> level zero. <laughs> Questobel level zero. I'm, I'm good for it. Let's do it. Let's let's right. see let's see what happens to poor young Questabel uh, when oh, she is uh, when when she needs to um, yeah live under the tu the tutelage of uh, Father Level Zero um, yeah what is her birthday the year uh, twelve hundred maybe it should be today although I don't think that's going to give us really spe spectacular stats if we make it today but oh well it is. Do we have an idea of how her the uh, her is birthday is very important? Uh, like, okay, well then let's 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 give her a chance. <laughs> let's give her a chance. Yeah. All what right. is I, what is I an think... auspicious day for her to have been born? I think the fourteenth of what was that? Six June. Uh, must be. Yeah, June fourteenth. Let's give it that, and we got to enter our age. June, let's add June our thirteenth is my brother's birthday. <laughs> So there you go. <laughs> there um, you go. Yeah. Um, let's be seventy-two. Jeez, we are not a young <laughs> lad. Are we going to survive this? This is like the dark <laughs> ages, man. <laughs> the the, the backspace right. key will work. Are we going to be seven hundred twenty? Is that what you're doing to us? Seventy-two is fine. Seven hundred and twenty. 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 No, 20. that's too young. Four. 42. 42. There you go. That has connotations. Right. Huh? Yeah, I'm, I'm down with it. Yeah. All right. 42 All right. is good. What is our birthday? And now we're going to select our birthday. Yep. Um, maybe our birthday should be today. All right. So that's January, February, March. And we're doing this the day before, so it'll be Thursday the 15th. The fifteenth. It'll be Friday the fifteenth. Yeah, right? Friday the fifteenth. That's when this will, that's when this episode will air. Well, we're recording. It's actually, on not that. So. It's not. It's not exactly true, but it's close enough. Yeah. Now for her blood type. Her blood type is also important, as as anybody who's 
I, now, correct me if I'm wrong, but in Japanese culture, blood type is like kind of a thing. Yeah, that's a that's a big thing with uh, just mm-hmm. Asian culture in general. Actually, uh, it's 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 treated in a lot of ways the same way as we treat your horoscope, you like your your birth date. So. Um, uh, your right. blood type is sort of meant to uh, define your personal characteristics. Like, uh, like I'm I'm an O, and O's are meant to be um, kind of indecisive and wishy washy. Um, right, whereas right. A's are supposed to be like like you know the the alphas <laughs> okay. of sorts. You know. Let's. Hmm. Let's go mm-hmm. with. I know for a fact yeah. that bees will give you minus two distress. Oh, yeah. Okay. Y- yeah. yeah be- bees are supposed month. to be like the passionate, active people. Um, they love animals, but they're irresponsible and kind of forgetful. Oh, shit. Oh, what did you yeah. do? There was once a city in the world of mortals. Its king was proud of his position. Its people were arrogant with their wealth. Its rulers made light of the gods and we ceased to worship them. Its people sank into butter and sloth. The lord became angry at this and summoned the prince of darkness who lived underworld. Accepting the lord's will, he attacked the world of mortals. Wow. Sorry, I almost missed You that. handled that. <coughs> I had to. Yeah. It was a one-sided war. The soldiers of the capital, grown accustomed to peace, fell helplessly before the powerful demon army. The ramparts were destroyed and the castle was engulfed in flames. It was clear that something blah 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 blah. <laughs> Seeing the flight of the capital, the wandering swordsman, Level Zero, threw himself into the battle against the Prince of Darkness. One night, Level Zero stole into the demon's encampment and defeated the Prince of Darkness and blah. Person. You have beaten me! <laughs> <laughs> But why are you fighting for these stupid people? It has been divinely ordained that I attack this decadent capital. It's no concern of yours. I killed only fools. Level Zero didn't know how to respond. Suddenly, the Prince of Darkness disappeared along with his army, returning to the underworld to recover from his defeat. Brave warrior, you have saved the capital. It is I who foolishly brought this one upon us as this divine punishment for my decadence. If you had not appeared, the city would surely have perished along with me. It was my fault as well. <laughs> the king and I have resolved to make a fresh start. We will work together to restore the capital. You appear to have been wounded. Why don't you stay in the capital and help us rebuild? We beseech you. Beseech you. <laughs> and thus level zero came to live in the capital and be granted a salary by the king. 614. 1209 KD. One night, when the stars were shining brilliantly in the heavens, Level Zero felt somehow bleh. Level Zero. (laughs) A voice called out to Level Zero from the heavens. As he lifted his head, he spotted a shooting star. Before his eyes, it slowly descended to the top of a nearby hill. Made he ran look. to the hill. There he found a floating sphere, which was surprising, frankly. <laughs> Made you look, level zero. <laughs> then he noticed that inside the light, there was a little girl. Girl. Level zero, I am Questabel's garden, Mercury. Her garden. This darling child has lived in the sacred light since she was, was born. She is an innocent soul and knows nothing about the impure world about the myrtles. <laughs> now I entrust you with this child child (laughs) your actions alone will determine whether she will live or die and what kind of life she will lead it is all up to you that is all I have to ask I will be watching from the he avens (laughs) oh mercury you so crazy a year passes time to put her to work see that star over there that's Dude. where you came from. I am not your father. <laughs> That's your mom. <laughs> Good morning, master. Your butler cube is at your service. Oh, great. I love it. Your daughter, Questabel, is healthy and happy. It's time to decide on her schedule for the month. All right. So here okay. we are. There is young Questabel. She, uh, she looks uh, prim and proper and ready to go. She is 10 years old. Mm-hmm. We have 500 gold as a family. Yep. And we're ready to go. 
We are super ready to go. All right. So, so we're going to be seeing a lot of this screen. This is kind of uh, this is kind of the only screen of the game. Yeah, let's let's give so. our viewers the primer uh, on uh, Princess <laughs> Maker before we start. In case you're not familiar with this game, and I'm not sure how you would have gotten here otherwise. Generally speaking, you would kind of have to be looking for Princess Maker for you to find it. But uh, or you just be subscribed to us. Yes, absolutely. If thing. if you are a level zero watcher and you're not already familiar with uh, Princess Maker, here is the game, Matt. Together. Yes, okay, so here's your scores. Okay, so we're super smart. Yeah. And that's about it. <laughs> we're, not, we're not so <laughs> She's bad. She's sensitive we're a as healthy. well. Yeah. She would make a good sensitive. artiste. Yeah. Yes. We can we can do whatever we want. I should have put her in July. That's okay. We'll be fine. <laughs> that's all right. Father daughter chat. Okay, so you can talk to her. Yep. Um, so these are free actions, basically, right? Like these are free actions. Yeah, every month you have a doing. chance to do this. Yeah. yeah. So basically, so we, we can... only really interact with our daughter once a month, uh, unless yes, there's a very correct. special occasion. Um, exactly. Otherwise, yeah. The idea is this is this is basically like a tamagotchi. You uh, you have your daughter here, and you create a schedule her for for her for the month, and then basically Cube runs her life from that point forward until the end of the month. Exactly. When, exactly. Yeah. I wonder what kind of person my mother was. <laughs> well, Christabel, you don't have a mother. Nope. Not even so there, immaculate conception. Out. Yeah, so we did that that one thing, this and is, there's only one thing this... that you can do uh, per per basically these options here. Uh, we can yeah. also give her stuff, right? This is her diet. Yeah. Um, we're not going to change her diet because she's ten. Yeah, you um, don't want to necessarily starve out a ten year old. I mean, no. you know, if she turns you out to be really a little want... shit, maybe, but you know, we'll uh, <laughs> this we'll is get one there. of. Yeah, this is one of the disturbing things. Um, what is this? Now let's give it a click. Oh, ah. this, is, this is her stats. Her, okay. her sort of general stats. So, like, her her birth date and her age, her blood type, her sign. She's a Gemini. Her patron is Mercury. Um, she has a normal diet. Yeah. Her height is she's 4 foot 10. Her weight is she's 93 pounds mm -hmm. she is uh has a bust of 29 and a waist of 21 and a hip of 30 there you go um that's going to go up significantly well i mean she's going and to she hit puberty older. pretty soon exactly so how many years so, is the is the standard run of princess maker 2 i think till she's 18 i believe you're I right i may be wrong and we'll figure that out before we go too far in the game but um, I'm not sure what the star is. I think here. that is. Oh, yeah, that's I just can save the game. All right, and yeah, it's basically you you pray to the gods to allow you the chance to to do to do over if you fuck up too bad. Yeah. Oh, and this is shopping. Yeah. What's um, so the we town? Can her, we can take her to the town and take her shopping. Yep. Uh, for for stuff. Let's go into town. Yeah. Let's, let's take a quick drop in town. So we can go to the armorer. And buy her armor, her which we're not here. No, not yet. Eh? Tailor to not buy yet. clothing. If we're yeah, not satisfied with her little pink dress, some of the stuff you can feed her will help her stats. Yep. Um, you can sell stuff at the pawn shop. You can take her to church and or the hospital if she needs. Uh, if she becomes a delinquent, we're gonna have to take her to church. Yeah. <laughs> so we're gonna see that eventually. Well, we'll see. Yeah, I don't know. Well, I don't know. Right, Are you? Would you consider yourself an expert at Princess Maker? Because if you're not, no. I know I played a shit ton of Princess Maker when I was younger, and uh, I there was not a single daughter I had that didn't become a delinquent at some point. That's true. Yeah, that's true. I've had a few actually that okay. haven't, but this oh, is going to be a problem. I think maybe I'm just right, a bad dad. This is why I chose never to have children. <laughs> Questabel arrives at the palace. Good day, miss. What is your business here at the palace? I've come to see the people here. Ho, ho, ho. You want to make connections, eh? You're quite a modern woman. Well, then. Let me give you some advice. The more important the person you talk to, the greater effect your reputation will be. Oh, I know important people easily agree with me. We are. <laughs> she, he's melting already. No, it's we'll too early. We'll stick with the garden. What should I do? 
Always be polite. A kinder ranking the person. The higher ranking the person, the more particular they are about etiquette. Etiquette. Yeah. So yeah, you can work your way up uh, in the court. Uh, but you do need to get better with etiquette, which means basically like courtly training. So, uh, yes. yeah, you you want to start low with like him. We're you gonna, can we're also start with the guard. Yeah, you can also send her over to meet and talk to like the court jester and stuff like that. If you want her to be, uh, if if you don't want to take her up the uh, the royalty path, um, which is completely an option, right? Like. The, the one of the cool things about Princess Maker basically is is it's all about defining what you want the end game to be and then working your way towards it, right? Like um, the end game does not have to be the perfect ending of her becoming the queen, right? Like, no, um, or princess, or princess. Actually, the princess princess is is I think the the I the, mean the, like yeah. top of the pinnacle. Yeah, yeah, well, I mean the queen, basically, yeah, princess slash queen. Um, although well, I guess queen, queen, queen of the underworld is an option as well if you decide that you want yeah. to to make her super bad and like basically she ends up marrying Satan, who fucking went and, and was that, actually the yeah, that the guy, yeah, the, the dude who you fought, who you She'll fought marry him, yeah. Um, or I mean, she can be a jester. She can work in a brothel. There's n- any number of things that could possibly happen. We don't know yet. What are you aiming for? What are you going to do with with her? Yeah. Like, what so, are you thinking? Is is the uh, is is your plan here? We've got the schedule up. Now. Okay, so we only have a half month. Oh, we it's, do. It's right. So we 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 define half months for her to do, but yeah. the first month of the game. Since her birthday was in the middle of the month, is only going to be a half month, mm. or it might okay, be just well, a couple days anyway. But so, so here, here's what happens: then, yeah. like school costs money, yeah, right, yeah, it's, and work it's generally makes money. Almost all positive stat changes to go to school, yes. Uh, but work, uh, work will have, although not necessarily. There's some schooling, that, yeah. That there's some will... schooling that, and stress levels will definitely rise. Um... Work. So let's put also. her in. Let's let's get some more money. Let's put yeah, her. Yeah, work, work will will give her life experience and raise her life skills, and also uh, get a little bit of cash for town or so for things. So based on her stats, what do you think she'd be good at? She's good at sensitivity. Maybe she'd be a good babysitter. She could be a decent a babysitter. Money. It's it's not a whole lot of cash, but uh, I don't think she would do well at the restaurant or inn yet, uh, and definitely not the farm. All right, she just doesn't have do the, she doesn't have the strength, the physical characteristics necessary. I don't think to. to and then we'll we'll so give her long. some time off. Okay, that's great. Yeah, I mean, you know, first month of or first month of her life, basically with you, where, um, you know, beyond just straight up childhood. So, yeah. Well, you, we got we had a full year, and it's to only get a week, her, right? And... Like it's six six days of of relaxation. Yeah, so it shouldn't be too bad. So. Let's go. Yeah. I like, how shall be done. I like how I'm framing free time as being like a bad choice, but go on. Yeah, <laughs> it's not. It's not at all. It costs thirty gold to feed your daughter for the month. It's only really the best way to get rid of stress. Yeah. Starting today, Questabelle will work at the local daycare center. Babysitting isn't really a difficult task. However, you've been entrusted with other people's children, so don't let your attention falter for an instant. Today didn't go so well. Today didn't go well. Today didn't go well. Today didn't go well. Today didn't go well. <laughs> Today didn't go well. Today didn't go well. Oh, Today didn't go well. Boy. Today didn't go well. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh. If you can't babysit, you'll never be a good mother. Yeah, this game is super sexist, by the way. <laughs> well, okay, um, yes, it's it's. Uh, we'll, I mean, we'll, let's quantify that. It is sexist, but it is sexist. Because of two things. One, uh, it is a game that is made in Japan that has different social uh, yes. values than us, and it is also uh, made in uh, made to reflect the sensibilities of medieval era Europe. Absolutely, yeah. But it's still a little. It's it takes you back. It takes you back a little bit. Oh yeah, no, it. it is definitely. It is definitely not. <laughs> it back. Not yeah. Um, uh, progressive by any right. <laughs> um, yeah. So that's just that's Let's just. Let's talk the way about it is, but. other topics. Yeah. 
I guess I'm just about average height. All right. We well, we, we that's had our a, bonding conversation. Yeah, that's all the time that we have. So before we get into her second month, uh, I would like to thank everybody for joining us uh, on this uh, on the the beginning of a new journey with Princess Maker Two, and we will return very soon with more. But uh, for now, thank you very much. Uh, thank you, Questabel, uh, for being a good hostess, uh, and uh, and we'll see y'all next time. All right, guys, everybody, take it easy. Bye. Yeah. Bye. Do, 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 do.